Hello, everybody. Today, I want to explain to you the relationship between exterior of the horse and shape of the saddle to achieve a proper saddle fit. Here we have our horse CJ. You see, it's a very compact modern horse with compact lines everywhere. You see the blood type top line rising to the crook. You see that the distance between shoulder blade and the deepest point of the top line is rather short. So the function we want is stretch between middle of the back and middle of the neck. So we need to make sure it's the easiest for the horse biomechanically to carry the weight by at the base of the withers. So if we look at the saddle, this distance is key. It has to be in the saddle, which means from the from the head iron to the deepest point of the top uh, of the of the top line has to be in the saddle. If you stick it on, you see you have this distance in it plus a certain angle that keeps you straight and in balance. Plus, you see that sea chase is rather wide, the widths area. So what we did is we created a saddle which has a wider distance here, which is called DJ Largo. Uh, so if you put the saddle on, CJ can bend in both directions without any friction. Plus, with this placing of the rider's weight, we support this function, stretch between middle of the neck, middle of the back and middle of the neck. The structure of a horse works in an indirect relationship. If the back goes up, the neck goes down. If the back goes down, the neck comes up. So we want to really achieve this situation is not the opposite.